trying to get Storm back over to him. That's where he's supposed to be. The ref over here paying attention. Got Brody. Uh oh. 187 has made his way to the ring. Hawk doesn't see him. Oh, big one right there. Oh, big double DDT to Hawk. Ref needs to turn around. Look what's going on. Serpent has Hawk. Ref sees it. One, two, three. That's it. Terry Wayne now comes in, the other half of the hooligans. He's already been see, in the red. Let's get some help. I Come don't blame now. Terry Wayne at all for this. This is exactly what should happen. Look, oh. There you go. Oh. Hey, what is this piece Chris of trash Hayes. doing out here? That's Chris Hayes out here. What is oh, this piece of Mike trash doing? This him. piece of trash right there. You Leave know better. Up. You know this piece of trash. Has no, he has no business out Who's here. stopping him? He has no piece. You got another guy Chris coming Hayes. out. You know you can't uh, have got a roll up. One, two, two you can't three. Oh, no. We've got a new TV title champion. Nothing good about this morning. Where is Lou at? You know, I'm sick and tired of everybody here. I'm, I'm sick and tired of you. I'm sick and tired of Chris Hayes. I'm sick and tired of Lou. I'm sick and tired of these idiots out here. Get Lou out here right now. Get Lou out here. Get him out here right now. Lose it. We're sick of Lou Winston. Well, there he is right behind you. Big Lou Winston. I want my rematch now, not not next week, now, not later tonight, right now. Mike, I already have a match. I already have a match scheduled for today. Don't worry, you be. Na I I got you later. I I got one for you later. Yes, because this one is already scheduled for today, so you get one later. You'll get a title match later. Hey, I, I also. Also, you got a tag team title match today, too. I don't have a tag team title yes, match. Yes, He's hurt. He's hurt. I, He's it, hurt. it don't matter. He's Guess hurt. what? He's going back down behind the desk where he's going to be. No. That's what you're going behind no. the desk again. No, no. You no. cannot make that happen. Let me, let me. You are exceeding your authority. Hey, let me tell you. My authority give me the right to do it. So you get behind the desk, what? and you know what? You got a title match today. Okay? Against who? Against who? We'll see. Don't, why you worried about against who? You scared? No, I'm not scared, but my partner is injured. I can't wrestle. What is it? It's a tag team deal. That's, that's okay. That's okay. It's okay. I'll get a partner. I'll have one. Hey, we'll see. Hey, 
Hey, get behind the desk. Get behind the desk. Can, can we talk about him being behind? Do I have to? Yeah. Thank you, Barry, for putting up with him another day. All right, y'all heard it. Big Lou. Hey, look, look, you know what? It seems like Roy is really worried these days. What's going on? Where your belt at? Oh, I forgot. Y'all heard it. Big Lou right there. What? You better watch it, Lou. Let me tell you people out there, this is a conspiracy against royalty. You have been conspiring with all these other people to – Storm. I got you. Storm. I got you. Lou, I get it. You're on a power trip. I know you need to feel good about yourself because Johnny knocked your ugly block off two weeks ago and left you laying. I get it. You're salty. And you got all this inbred trash here in the studio today trying to convince you you're doing the right thing. But you're going to step too far. And you're going to find out the hard way when it comes to royalty. You will never have a leg up on us. Get used to it. I think this is the second week, and I do have the leg up on you. That's why you're going back there, and I will keep an eye on you. You're going back there, and you're going to work with Barry. And, and I got you later. Well, there you have it, folks. Words from Big Lou. I tell you what, we're going to get all this sorted out, figure out where we're going to be. We'll be right back. Blue Note Freight is hiring for drivers and owner-operators. Must have three years driving experience. $20 an hour, 50 cents a mile, $2,000 bonus. Contact Blue Note Freight, 833-325-8668, extension 1. If you're looking to ride in luxury for a special event, contact a Polet Concierge. Ride in style. All you have to do is call Marcus Henderson at 901-643-9164, the Poland Concierge. Yeah. What is B-O-B-A? B-O-B-A stands for Black Owned Business Alliance. An alliance of businesses working together to serve the whole Mid-South with great services 24-7. Some of the businesses BOBA provides are vehicle lockouts, roadside assistance, boxing and fitness classes, celebrity and residential shuttle services, a full in-house record label, and more. So call us today, 888-605-BOBA. That's 888-605-2622. Our father opened Memphis Best Soul Food Shop and Save over 32 years ago with the promise of that great southern hospitality that the South is known for and that great soul-pleasing, lip-smacking soul food that our mothers and grandmothers were known for. With hot, fresh, and ready food every day. In the morning, our fresh salmon croquettes, bacon, smoked sausage, and eggs. And in the evening, our famous chili mac, ham hocks, yams, and greens. And don't forget dessert with Miss Faye's famous banana pudding and Miss Maddie's peach cobbler. Thank you for letting us serve you for 32 years and many more. Come down to Resource! Welcome back to Bluff City Wrestling Live here in Memphis, Tennessee. We are sitting here in our new location at the Oyo Hotel at 6101 Shelby Oaks Drive. Did you say Oyo or Oreo? Because I see another bunch of punk old school cookies out here in the audience. Well, that's right. Big Lou has done it to me again. I've got... Commentating right here. That's right, Barry. Your your commentating team has taken a step up towards greatness. 
because Big Daddy Storm is here on commentary once again by popular demand. Well, our next match is entering the ring right now. We've got Vicious High. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. We saw them last week. I'm telling you, these two guys. Take on some newcomers. They are a team to be reckoned with. Well, we saw them take on some newcomers, uh, Dakota and Colby, and those two were really good. Just not enough for Vicious Highs. They are a supreme tag team. I will give them that. Hey, look, they're a great tag team. They're getting it done. They're getting it done every week. This week, they'll be taking on Clayton Gross. Oh, looks Caleb like Caleb Dakota. Dakota went out and found him a new partner. I believe Colby. And look, I got a feeling the result's going to be the exact same because you're going against Vicious Hyde. And these two guys know exactly what they're doing. They improve week to week, Barry. There is nobody better save the Savage Brotherhood. I'll, I'll give them that. They, they are a supreme tag team. Mick, Mick Vicious does have control. So he's going to show him how it's done with a monster, and that's what he does have. That's right. He's giving him instructions right now. Mick talking to his monster, giving him instructions, because he's the one person that we found knows how to handle Solomon High. But look at that. Oh, look at that. I don't know if this is the best decision. Dakota came out, attacked him from behind. Probably good. Hide. Oh, that drop kick didn't work. Go try him. Boom, oh. look at him. Flying press. But he was caught. Look, oh! Clayton Cross comes out, takes him from behind. Mick Vicious over the top rope. Oh, Mick Clayton over the Cross. top. Solomon Hyde into the ropes, double team. Oh. oh, what a double drop kick. Oh, look at that, Mick, Solomon. Mick, Mick pulls his out. monster out. Oh, Lord, they have got him fired up. They are, these two guys are looking really good to start off the day. But these I guarantee guys, you, all they're doing, all they're doing, it's making the monster mad. They're making you. the monster mad. And look, here's the problem. Here's the problem. Everybody concentrates on the monster, but you better start concentrating on Mick Vicious. Mick Vicious is the brains behind that outfit. And Mick Vicious, everybody overlooks that man, but they shouldn't. Uh, right. He knows what he's doing. This dude is a machine in there. Big knee to the midsection of Dakota. Those big arms. His tree trunks. Two count by referee Allen. Again, Lance. Solomon Hyde. You can tell he's been coached up well because he constantly goes for the tag. Uh, Mick Vish is outside, choking Dakota. Clay Croft trying to come in, trying to help break it up. Referee Allen Lynch stops him from coming in. Look, and you should hear Solomon Hyde heard that sound. He and then boom. Oh, big, big brain. brain buster. Yeah, you got Look it. at that. Right on his head. Dropped him solid on his head. Look at Dakota's back. Where Ooh, he hit him with big those. headbutt. I'm telling you, man, Mick Vicious. Mick Vicious, Barry. He, 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 I won't give him that. He is a, he, he's mean. Here, and here's the thing about Mick Vicious. Mick Vicious is a great singles competitor. But he is transitioning very well into a tag team connoisseur, and I love seeing it. Yeah, he's a blatant choke right there on Dakota. Absolutely. Choke, choke him shirt. out. Choke him out. Put on. him out right now. To be a tag team specialist, these are the things you have to do, Barry. Well, there he was. These are the things you have to do. That, he heard the sound, and he tagged. Dakota's of course they tagged. Stupid ref didn't even see him tag, but they, of course they did. Hey, yeah. Look at that. Another clean tag by Solomon Hyde. Not, finally, a legal tag. Dude, they've been legal tagging. Now double team. Dakota into the ropes. Back up. Oh, oh another flapjack. That flapjack there is That flapjack is brutal. He kicks out at two count. Dakota, he needs to get a tag on Clayton Cross I'm gonna, pretty soon. I, I, I will tell you this. I have been on the receiving end of that flapjack, and it is not pleasant. It'll it is not nose. pleasant. 
Dude, it will do so many things. It's not pleasant at all. When they hit you with that thing, you're going to feel it. You're going to feel it in your soul. Solomon Hyde has him up on the uh, on the top rope. Dakota with right fist. Yeah, Dakota has a lot of fight left in him. Look, I'll give it to the young guys. They're not backing down. They're not quitting. And look, you can't be in this. Oh, Tornado DDT. Look at that. Oh, that was a big move. Desperation move from Caleb Dakota. Look at him go. Great move by him. Oh, springboard. Oh, kept up. up. Oh, big tag. Got a cross. Oh, cross comes in and a, just firing away. Cross is like a man possessed. Oh, he is. And look at that reversal by me. Oh, he, oh come on. Oh, oh, Mick hurt. Mick's oh. hurt. Solomon Hyde Mick's hurt. Got him on his oh, knee. he caught him on that leg. Mick, oh, spear. A spear. Woo. That vicious spear. Two, three, three. that's it. <laughs> that's it. Mick vicious with that spear. Wow. Another, another the, the dominant only. performance. By Vicious Hyde. Solomon Hyde to come in. This is never good. I, I'm hoping it's just to get his arm raised. He's trained him. There you go. You're him. winners. You're winners. Vicious Hyde. Look at him go. Blue Note Freight is hiring for drivers and owner operators. Must have three years driving experience. $20 an hour, 50 cents a mile, $2,000 bonus. Contact Blue Note Freight. 833-325-8668, extension one. If you're looking to ride in luxury for a special event, contact a Polet Concierge. Ride in style. All you have to do is call Marcus Henderson at 901-643-9164. A Polet Concierge. B-O-B-A. B-O-B-A stands for Black Owned Business Alliance, an alliance of businesses working together to serve the whole Mid-South with great services 24-7. Some of the businesses B-O-B-A provides are vehicle lockouts, roadside assistance, boxing and fitness classes, celebrity and residential shuttle services, a full in-house record label, and more. So call us today, 888-605-BOBA. That's 888-605-2622. Our father opened Memphis Best Soul Food and Shop and Save over 32 years ago with the promise of that great southern hospitality that the South is known for and that great soul pleasing lip smacking soul food that our mothers and grandmothers were known for. With hot, fresh, and ready food every day. In the morning, our fresh salmon croquettes, bacon, smoked sausage, and eggs. And in the evening, our famous chili mac, ham hocks, yams, and greens. And don't forget dessert with Miss Faye's famous banana pudding and Miss Maddie's peach cobbler. Thank you for letting us serve you for 32 years and many more. Come down to the resource! Welcome back to Bluff City Wrestling Live here in Memphis, Tennessee. We are actually at our new location at the Oyo Hotel, 6101 Shelby Oaks Drive. You can come and attend the taping free of charge. And it's what Bluff City does, right? It's what Bluff City does for their fan base. Even the pieces of trash that are here in the audience today got in free. And it's what they do. And it's what they do. And I'm still here with... Big Daddy Storm, half of the world 
tag team champion. That's right. You're welcome. Tiger is still out with the true scout Memphis wrestling at Bluff City. Tell you what. Not sports entertainment, not trash bag wrestling, true professional wrestling right here. And we got some of Tiger's new talent scouts out here. That's it. Kobe Gordy coming out. Going to be taking on. Oh, and he's got his opponent. And and his opponent's going to be is another new talent. We've seen him here the last few weeks. It is. Trying to make a name for himself here in Bluff City. Hey, they. See what Tiger's been up to. See what he's been doing here. Look, well, he ought to be doing something instead of eating McDonald's all day long because that's all he's been doing. Come on. All right, he's been going to Osceola, visiting some of those little trash restaurants they got over in that little crap hole town. And that's, that's all it does. He, he's not out scouting. He's scouting burger joints. Well, oh, and here we here, go. Jordy, I like this guy. Jordy is, you know. I like this guy. He, he's out here to take on the new talent in Kobe. Look. We have seen Jordy here before. I've been in the ring with this guy. He's got some talent. He's not afraid. He don't back down. I give it to him. Kobe's going to be in for it today. Referee Alan Lance calls for the bell. This will be a one-fall match here. They tie up. Elbow collar tie up to a standing headlock. Gordy wrenching down. Oh, big elbows there. By Kobe. Kobe takes Gordy into the ring. Oh, Whoa, big shoulder block by Jordy. Shoulder block by, see, one thing about Gordy, he, he always flaunts to the crowd. He needs to keep his eye on him. Into the ropes. Oh. Kobe up and over. Up. Wow, no, big arm drag. Back over. Low since a deep arm drag for him. Oh. Close line. Big drop kick. Look at that. Looking good by this new kid here got going on. Tiger I'll tell you out what. scouting. He's he found some pretty good talent here. Kobe looks pretty good. Yeah, you know, I think last week when he made his debut back here at Bluff City, he was a little bit nervous, but he looks a little more settled today. I believe he does. Looks a lot more settled today. He's got his back turned. That's all. And that's a mistake. Yeah, that's the inexperience. That's a mistake. There. That is that is complete inexperience. Jordy's going to take him over. Look at him. I don't know what he's directing over here, but look. He's being a little flamboyant over here on the ropes. Got him coming in. Hey, look. He's focused. That's all that matters. Jordy with the knee to the midsection. Kobe takes him up. Oh, here we oh, go. Big scoop slam. Up. Boom. Mm. Again, it, kids got mm. talent. Yeah. Uh, this, come on. You got it. Take right here, right? Yeah. You, you've got to stay on your guy. You can't. You got to. Uh-oh. Oh. No, there's JPJ coming in. Oh. Oh. Oh, referee calls for the bell. JPJ clothesline both of them. Oh, he Hides just. Here's a big slam with a knee. Oh. Oh, oh that big slam. Oh, every Allen Lynch calling for the bell again. Try to get some help Look at out this. Here. This dude has There's been no angry. Nothing but we're... angry. Oh, oh. oh. Ooh, he's always calling out the king there. Let me get over you go here. take care of that. Big JPJ just took out both of our new guys here. What you got on your mind? Hey, I, I feel bad. I don't know these two guys, but it doesn't matter. You know, I've been wrestling for a long time. I work down the road. It's the first time anybody put me in front of a microphone. But here's the deal. When I signed with Bluff City, I was promised a title shot. Storm, where's your boy at? He's on vacation because of Lou Winston. That's where he's at, Jack. You know that. Okay, well, do me a favor then. You go tell Johnny Dotson, the Kang superstar, that I bow to no man. You go tell the Kang superstar that he needs to shine up the yesteryear that he used to have. Because when he comes back, I'm the next heavyweight champion. Hey, but do me another favor, and I hope he's listening. Johnny, get on Facebook. Run your mouth. Tell everybody how great you are. Because when I put this night-night knee in your life, that's it. 
he'll be on a permanent vacation. Okay. Right. Hey. And before I walk off, if you and Mr. Brody Hawk or Mike Reels have a problem with it, don't hit me from behind. I'm not hard to find. Face to face, be a man. There you have it. JPJ comes out calling out the Kang. Of course, the Kang has been suspended indefinitely by Lou Winston. He can't come back until Lou tells him he can come back. Big words from JPJ there. Yeah, it's real easy. You come out here beat up, beat up a bunch of nobodies, but that's not the Kang superstar out there. Uh, you come out beating up somebody else, you're not beating up the Kang after the Kang left him laying. Believe me, the message will be sent to Johnny Dotson. But he's out. Shut up, lady. I, I, everybody can hear you, but hear me. Because Jack needs to. Johnny Dotson is a whole different animal trying to climb that mountain than what Jack is used to. This isn't sports entertainment, son. This is professional wrestling. I hope you're ready for it. Well, you hear it there from Storm. We'll be right back with more Bluff City Wrestling live right after these messages. Not happening. Blue Note Freight is hiring for drivers and owner operators. Must have three years driving experience. Twenty dollars an hour, fifty cents a mile, two thousand dollars bonus. Contact Blue Note Freight eight three 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 two five eight six six eight extension one. If you're looking to ride in luxury for a special event, contact a Poulet Concierge. Ride in style. All you have to do is call Marcus Henderson. At 901-643-9164, the Poland Concierge. Yeah. What is BOBA? BOBA stands for Black Owned Business Alliance an alliance of businesses working together to serve the whole Mid-South with great services 24-7. Some of the businesses BOBA provides are vehicle lockouts, roadside assistance, boxing and fitness classes, celebrity and residential shuttle services, a full in-house record label, and more. So call us today, 888-605-BOBA. That's 888-605-2622. Our father opened Memphis Best Soul Food Shop and Save over 32 years ago with the promise of that great Southern hospitality that the South is known for and that great soul pleasing, lip smacking soul food that our mothers and grandmothers were known for. With hot, fresh, and ready food every day. In the morning, our fresh salmon croquettes, bacon, smoked sausage, and eggs. And in the evening, our famous chili mac, ham hocks, yams, and greens. And don't forget dessert with Miss Faye's famous banana pudding and Miss Maddie's peach cobble. Thank you for letting us serve you for 32 years and many more. Come down to Resource! Welcome back to Bluff City Wrestling live here in Memphis, Tennessee at our new location in the Oyo Hotel, 6101 Shelby Oaks Drive. That's right. Just right off of Sycamore View. Next, we're going to have ourselves. You're probably not going to like this one. No, I don't because it's a bunch of crap. Another, Again, another Lou Winston special. That's it's what this is. It's our next is our TV title match. Here we go. Lou Winston came out earlier, and Mike Reels wanted a match. He was mad, but he already had one scheduled between Chris Hayes and Fancy Bryce Dancy. You're bringing out the Backwoods King. This is the reason 
Mike Grills is no longer the television champion because of this dude. He had Fancy Bryce Dancy beat to sleep. And because of this guy, now he's no longer the TV champion. He gets a shot. Chris Hayes actually, you know, he's a headhunter. He's come out. He's been looking at Mike Reels for some time. He just came out to watch the match a little bit. No, Mike Reels. Pay. Stop. Stop. Stop lying. Stop Mike Reels couldn't excuses. pay attention. So, the hey. fact of the matter is Lou Winston set this whole thing up. Well, Lou did make the matches. He of course he did because he's he, because Mike Reels lost his ma lost his title. Anything to keep Mike Reels away from and royalty from having gold. Well, there he is, ladies and gentlemen, the new TV title. Another champion, piece of trash right there. Fancy Bryce Dancy. I swear, I don't know what day garbage pickup is, but it needs to back that truck in here because that whole side of the building needs to be taken to the dump. Uh, Fancy Bryce Dancy beat Mike Reels last week in what Big Daddy Storm would call a controversial win. The rest of us saw that as a one, two, three. I mean, it was controversial. Barry, come on. Don't be a tiger. I, I'm not. Don't be a tiger. Don't do this biased BS. Don't be a tiger. All right. Stop it. We all saw Chris Hayes come out here and distract Mike Reels. We saw that. They cheated. Fancy Bryce Dancy holding up that TV title. Chris Hayes has his eye on it for quite some time. Referee Alan Lance is showing the title to Chris Hayes. He's going to show it to everyone else. That's a great-looking title there. Look, look, it's a beautiful title, but it's even better being around the waist of Mike Reels. You shut up. I'm talking. I'm doing my job. There this is. is my job, lady. Shut up. Referee Alan Lentz calls for the bell. That is a great-looking title there. Fancy Bryce Dancy trying to get the fans behind It needs him. to be cleaned after being around the waist of Fancy Bryce Dancy. Oh, uh, Chris Hayes. I smell a little funk on it. Uh, throwing him in. Oh! Ooh. Ooh. Oh, wow. Big. Big vicious. That kick. Oh, might have ruptured his spleen back there. And I think Getting Bryce shot. Dancy is still suffering from that shoulder injury we saw in his win over Mike Reels. Big hip, hip toss. toss. That was a great hip toss. Big deep arm drag. I tell you what, Chris is focused. He is focused, and Bryce. Chris is focused. Okay. Hey, he's <laughs> but he's see, acknowledging it. But this is a problem. Move. Sportsmanship. I hate it. I hate it. He should have taken advantage of that situation right there, right there, and taken out Bryce Dancy. He had him on the ropes. There was no point uh -oh. and, 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 and no reason for him to do that. And now look, see, Bryce gaining an advantage right there. Only a one count right there. Look, I remember Bryce when he first got into this business. He has come a long, long way. That's why he's here at Bluff City now. This kid is up and coming. He can wrestle. He can get in this ring and he can go. He has came a very we long see way. It. He's great. Look at that quick arm drag of his own. Now he's got him sixed into a deep arm bar. Here we go. Got Chris Hayes locked down. I'm really surprised to hear you say you, you like the way he's wrestling and all that. He's actually in here in the in the wrestling in Bluff City Wrestling, been a clean wrestler. Who Bryce? Bryce has been a very clean wrestler. He gives the brakes clean, no scratching of the eyes and all. I mean, he's I, a very I get clean. Wrestler. I get it. It makes him feel better as a person, but it will not get you far wrestling like he does. I don't know, right. Storm. I'd have to disagree with you. Get him no, the, uh, this is because Bluff of Chris City Hayes. This is because of Chris Hayes. This right here is because of Chris Hayes. Right now, he has Chris Hayes down. Well, Chris Hayes. Oh, look at that reversal. Leg scissors. Wrenching down on it. Oh, Bryce. Back up to a head up. We're going to get it. Nope. Oh, headstand. Oh, back over. Yes, Chris. Oh, nope. into, into the, the ropes. Rope. Wow. Good catch by referee Allen Lance. Oh, headlock takeover. Caught him coming back up. I'm telling you, right here in Bluff City, we wrestle, baby. They we hit. wrestle here in Bluff City. It's been a great wrestling match. It so is far. old school, and that's what we do better than anybody. 
I'll, we'll have to agree with you on that one. That's one thing we will agree on. Very good technical wrestling. And we should also agree that Lou Winston is a crook. No good, no count. And he cost Mike Rills the title. That's, what, that's the other thing we should agree on. That's where we don't agree. Chris backs him into the corner. Shoulders in. Oh. He's breaking him down there. He got him from the front and the back all of a sudden. Oh. Hey, Look. a big whip in by Chris. Hey, setting him up. Comes back. Another splash. I tell you what, Chris Hayes is quick. Well, they, they call it in the head, Hunter, because he's stalking him. Oh, oh big huge kick step up in Zaguri. Oh, that, that right there to knock you out. And he I, connected I he solid is. on Bryce Dancy right there. See, again, taking Rolls his time. Up. Taking his time. Oh, only a two count there. Bryce just this, last second. Dude. These guys, they're trying to show their skill, and that's great and all, but if you're not trying to win the match, what are you doing? Oh, driving that knee right into the spine. Reverse chin lock. Bryce trying to wiggle around to try to get out of it. Oh, he's got him locked in. He's got him locked in. Referee Alan Lance asking him, does he want to give up? And Dancy says no. Oh, hey, he just, just throws him down. Just violently throws him down. Look, Chris Hayes is a different kind of human. Oh! Chris is a different kind of human being. There's no question about that. Uh, crowd asked for one more time. He gave it to him. I don't know how much more Dancy can take. Boom. Oh, then the elbow to the back of the head. Oh, he's been working that back over with those big kicks. But slow to the – what nope. is he don't doing? Don't pull him up. Wow, Un very unlike This Chris is Hayes. not going to win you a title. Stuff like this will not do it. You have got to put your opponent away when you can put him away. Oh, oh right into the Drop bottom Drop toe hold and right guillotined him across the bottom rope. Ooh. Outside, we've seen this move. That big Slow, right hand. Huge right. We've seen that many times. Dancing on his feet. I don't know if he knows he's I on his feet. I think he's out on his feet. I don't even think if he knows he's. They're going to square each other up. Look, look, I'll give Bryce this. I'll give Bryce credit. He is trying to, he is trying to collect himself and get back into this match. And he needs to, but this is a mistake on Chris Hayes' part. Let him stay in this match like this. This is not what you want to do. I don't understand the strategy here, and quite frankly, it's making me angry to even watch it. I will have to agree on that. I, he should have kept on, stayed on him. Let Why him get not? back up to his feet. Exactly. Now test the strength here. And look, look Bryce like is a strong dude. He is. Bryce is a strong guy. He's got Chris Hayes right now, it looks like. But Bryce is going to have to turn up the intensity as well. Like, he can't sit here and try to wrestle some clean little match. He's going to have to do something and get serious. There you go. Look at that. Uh, oh, he's got him locked out in the arm bar. That is a submission. Got him come on, submission. come on, come on. Breaking up because the leg was but, under But the Bryce rope. needs to stay on him. He needs to stay on him and take it to Chris. Hey, he's back out on the apron. Oh, oh now they're pulls, going to the outside. Pulls him out today. Look at this. They're getting a little violent here. I like it. Oh, oh huge right hand. right hand. Oh, Oh, Bryce comes back with big forearm shot. Two count. Big boot. Referee Allen Lance at three. Oh, posted him. There you go. Head right into this is post. what I'm talking about. You have got to be willing to turn up the intensity if you're going to win titles here in Bluff City. Dancing into the ring. It's and not back for out. the weak of heart. He stopped the count, got it restarted by referee Allen well, you, Lance. Well, you can't win the title outside. You've got to you win cannot. it in the ring. Now, here's Bryce what. up. Over. Oh, oh, nice. What an elbow. Two. Hey, a fancy way of doing an elbow, and I kind of like it. That's but here's the Bryce thing. Dancy, but here's what Bryce does not understand. He has the champion's advantage. He does. He could have stayed out here, worked over, got counted out, went home happy as the champion. But as a champion, you shouldn't want to win a match that way. You should want As a champion, you should want to win a match any way you can. Absolutely. Any and every way See, you can. There again, we agree to disagree. That's right, because I'm a champion, Barry. That, you and speaking are, as a champion, you are. This is what you got to do. He's got him in an arm bar of some type. Well, he's got him twisted team. around. He's got him locked in. He's using his leverage, and that's what you do. So when you get him locked out, you don't see any halfway done arm bars here. Look at this the way he's ha he's got him locked in. Good roll Good up. Roll oh, up. 
problem nope, is, nope. again, up. you roll them into the ropes. In a smaller ring like this, you have got to have situational awareness. You've got to be aware of where you are because could have been a near pinfall. Could have been a near pinfall right correct. there. And, oh. and now, look, those – look. Man, those Chris, kicks right there. Chris Ooh. is a huge striker, and he can. He can bring it. There's no question. Nobody's doubting that. Oh. oh. Bam. Oh. Had a Look at this. Kick, Here we punch, are. Punch, kick. I don't. Oh, that Superman big. Superman punch. Ooh. And that lays him out every time right Man, there, too. look at that. Ouch. Here it is. Hayes, I think, has had a lot of spin Chris right now. Chris is I don't eyeing him up it. right now. This is this is where he can he can take advantage of this. But Bryce has got to come back. Bryce has got to have eyes in the back He's of his got head. To. Uh, Hayes, I think he has taken a beating in this match. Bryce, there's no quit. He's telling He's Chris, come, come on. on. Oh, oh, a trouble in paradise. Shot. He is done. Ow. He has right knocked him completely out. I think they're both spent, though. I don't know. Bryce. He is Might trying to right get there. up. I don't. He, he actually got up from that. Wow. Oh. Oh, super, super kick. Mm. Man, he caught see, him flush on the jaw with that see. one. Good Lord. Bam. Oh, oh there it is. Good Lord. That's the kill shot. I think Man, he, he is out. And that's Lot three. Of fight in Bryce Dancy right here. But I will tell you what. This right here, you know this is crap, and you know this is trash, and you go back and you tell Lou Winston that this is trash, that he's out here doing this and giving trash like that, anybody, any shot at a title. You know that's crazy, and you know that's crap. It doesn't matter. He didn't deserve it in the first place. He didn't deserve it in the first place. Chris Hayes won the, won the That's belt. right. That's what? right. You heard me exactly what Chris I said. Chris reaching for the belt. Doing. Mike Reels you know made what I'm it doing. in. What? Get him. Get him, get him, get him, get him. What is this? Two, three, that's right. Oh, man. That's right, ring that bell. Lou said anytime. Lou said later. It's later. Uh, Big Lou did say that's later. That's it. Lou did said later, folks. This is later. I don't believe this, this is, is later. This is later. Lou had in mind, but he just, I don't. Ladies and gentlemen, I don't know if this is going to stand, <laughs> if this is going to happen. <laughs> Mike Reyes is off Chris Hayes I love in the middle of the ring. I love it. Telling referee Allen Lynch to raise his hand. And new Blob City television champion, Mr. Saturday Morning, Mike Reels. Ladies and gentlemen, I don't know if Let's this is going to happen. Let's see it, baby. Woo. Mike Reels Let's got go, the championship. Mike. Let's Chris Hayes laid right there. I don't know. What's wrong with Chris Hayes? Uh, he's, what's, what's, you, what's wrong with him? Uh, you hit him from behind. He's in the laid in the ring. You, you, you went guy straight you, up. The bell. Him. You rang the bell, right? No, he rang the bell. I didn't ring the bell. He Match started. Bell. That's all we know. Lou Winston did say later. It's later. I, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, we'll have to find out this. You this people game. need to get on your feet for the new Bluff City te Television Champion. Let's go. Ladies and gentlemen, we're going to have to see if this is going to stand by the big Lou. I don't know. Coming back. <laughs> Still have another match. Woo! Go. Buddy. I tell you what, ladies and gentlemen. How you feeling now, Lou? Let's take a break. We'll be back in just a moment with more Bluff City Wrestling Live. <laughs> Welcome back to Bluff City Wrestling Live. Right here live, from baby. Woo! Rem Referee Allen Lynn still trying to help Chris Hayes up. I'm so excited about what we just Mike witnessed, Reels. Barry. I bet you are. I'm so excited. Aren't you excited, Barry? Oh, we'll you be. should be excited, Barry. This I is bet. great. But I tell you what, we're going to have to find out if this is going to actually stand with Lou Hayes. I mean, Lou Winston. Hey, come on, come on. We're going we'll to watch the replay of this beautiful moment. Oh, come on. I mean, that's. Oh, yeah. I mean, you people at home, check this out. It's great. <laughs> this is great. <laughs> they did tell Lou, did say, he would give him a match. Uh, I don't know if he really even <laughs> a title match. He got the whole world oh. in his hands. Oh, he's got the whole wide world in his hands. <laughs> I'll tell you what. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I tell you 
Well, it's you're happy great. right now. I am happy. But I guarantee I can make that happiness go away. What? Right now, we're going to have the next match, which is a tag team handicap match. No, see, that's wrong. With the East Coast Bad Boys versus one half of Savage Brotherhood, Brody Alt. See, that's the best stuff, and that's, this should not even count. Oh, it's going to count, and I told you I could bring that down. There they are, ladies and gentlemen, the challengers, the East Coast Bad Boys. Lou Winston knows he's wrong for trying to set this up. It's He tried it with Mike Reels, and now he's trying it with the Savage Brotherhood because he knows there's nobody who can stand up to us. And this is what he does, taking advantage of somebody who's injured, trying to make my partner go at it alone. Well, this is not the first time. This is not the first time. Hey, well, it's going to happen today. It's going to happen right here. It's, it's about to happen right now. These fans out here chanting for the East Coast bad boys. You know you nothing but trash. You've got <laughs> Baby girl is not going anywhere with you. No, no, she's not. No, she's not. You got Serpent and 187 here. They are the fan favorites. Referee Alan Lentz has, for the last couple of weeks, been having to pull. No, I don't think so. Baby girl's going nowhere with you. Oh, you're going to see. Okay. Y'all yeah. funny. Y'all folks, I know y'all in lose back pocket. I know you're in lose back pocket. Referee Alan Lentz having to pull double duty for the last couple of weeks because Brody Hawk injured Let's Go Garrett Vance a couple of weeks ago. Uh, we hear Look, Brody Hawk's music. The Savage Brotherhood has been the dominant force in Bluff City Wrestling since we got here. Yeah. Nobody can stop Savage Brotherhood, and when they come into play with royalty, there is nobody who can stop the faction that is us. Oh, there he is. That's Brody what I'm talking Hall. about. See, you only thought it was going to be a handicap match. You okay. only thought it was going to be a handicap match. And you ain't not getting this belt. You're not getting baby girl. Accompanied by Mike Reels. That's right. Big Lou. You He's see. Already stated. This you see, Mike big, Reels no. can step in for Big Daddy. That's it. Mike Reels can step in for Big Daddy. Beat him, mate. Big. See, Mike Reels is going to take my spot. Big Lou, uh, Mike Re saying Mike Reels is going to take his see, spot. He don't have what to wrestle got? by himself. Mike, Mike, look, Mike got a partner. is going to go back to the dressing room. What? This is going to be, and you going back over there. You Come on, need a partner. This is a handicap match. Why are you going to make it a handicap match? Last week, when he beat you, that made him the number one contender. So you finna defend your belt as a handicap match. Get in the dressing room. What? No, you can't make it. Go to the dressing room. Mike is not going to be in this match. You are out here by yourself. And guess what? I'm going to be standing right over there to make sure you don't get involved. All right, ladies and gentlemen, you have, hey, Big Lou's going to send Mike Reels back to the back. Don't storm. Uh, Brody Hawk says it's not right, but I don't know. You know this is wrong, Lou. It is. Mike Reels hasn't. Mike Reels is getting the belt. We still got to find out about Mike Reels' belt. Find out if that's going to be legit or not. Got I know I'm doing a good job, but this is a tragedy. Ladies and gentlemen, I, we're waiting on it. It's going to be a handicap match hey. between the East Coast bad boys. Baby girls aren't going anywhere. I got this. They're not going anywhere. Brody Hawk. Look. Hey, hey, hey. Where are you taking baby girl? He's got to show them to the opponents. They Get your hands off my, my woman. Uh, servant said, hey, these look good on us. They've inspected them. Said they look really good. Hey. Alan Lynch. 
Wow. That ain't fair at all. Big you Lou know this is trash. Big Lou going over and picking up the belts from referee Alan Lentz. Woo. Let's see, we got a handicap match. See who's going to start. Where? Who's going to start out with him? Uh, Brody Hawk going after both. Alan Lentz. Match is underway. Oh, a bulldog oh, right come in the middle. On. Serpent hadn't even take, had a chance to take off his hat. Up, oh. in with the splash. Big, no oh, big come splash. On. Oh no! Ref, get him out of the ring. Double drop kick, right on top of Brody Hawk. No, 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 rope, 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 rope. Brody Hawk had his foot on the rope. Big Daddy Storm over here. Come on, Brody. He's had it on there. East Coast bad boys giving all they have. Oh, big arm bar into a double axe handle on Brody Hawk's arm. Crowd cheering for Serpent. Brody, oh, snapmare takeover. Serpent into, oh. oh come on. A little small drop kick into the side of the head. Check out Brody. Cover two. Oh, almost a three. The arm was coming down. Uh, legal tag. 187 back into the ring. Hawk into the ropes. Got double clothesline. Got it covered. Come on, come on, come on. Uh, Hawk kicks out as to three. I don't know if Hawk's going to be able to withstand this. 187. Uh, he wrenches on that arm again on the arm bar. Storm stands up. Come on, Brody. Cheering on his tag team partner. He's got him in a. Come on, like Rip, get him out of there. Big Lou, oh, oh, Big Lou catches. You see what he's doing, Lou? You see what he's doing up there? Come on. Going in, tells him it's a handicap. Up. Oh. There you go. Brody Hawk throws Don't. Serpent over the top rope. Oh. 187 catches him. At least Serpent hurt Come on, Brody. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, he's gassed, though. He, I think oh, come on, Brody. Good. Leave Serpent over there. Hurt Serpent's hurt. Nick. Good. Good. Brody Hawk now. In. Let's in go, Brody. Brody. Smash him. Finger. Break him. Like Break him, Brody. Break him, Brody. Get him off his fingers. Break him, Brody. Break him. Oh, there you oh, go. He steps on him. Serpent trying to make it. There you go. Step bringing him over to the ring. Oh, oh yeah. Tag partner over there. Break his hand, Brody. As Big Daddy storms over here. Break his hand, Brody. Uh, Brody. Uh, Brody. Brody. Uh, let's his go, let's go. He's got to break it for crying out loud. There you go. Take it apart. Take it apart, Time Brody. Take it apart, Brody. Uh, oh. Right, big right hand by Hawk. Another right hand. Beat him to death. Take him out. Take him out. Oh, and it's Serpent trying to get him in there. Got him in there. Look out. Boom, oh. baby. Yeah. Oh, and it Let's him go. Out. Oh, no. Let's go. Woo. Look at that. Oh, now he's got the strut. There you that, go. Fargo strut, baby, because they can do it all night long. Brody Hawk just over here. Just you got it. Then you got this. Hawk telling Storm he's got it. Boom. Oh, boot right across those laces. That's it. Come on. That's it. Brody, I'm breaking that arm. arm again. That's it. I'm in that arm bar. There you go. Referee Allen Lentz with the three count. You see, this is what I'm talking about, Barry. We've been after that arm for the last four weeks. We've been destroying that arm right there. We don't forget. We don't forget. Again, true professional wrestlers right here in Bluff City. Got a oh, rake in the eyes. There, there you go. go. That blind him. Blind him. Stepping on his fingers, raking his eyes. That's what, That's what you do. That's what you do. Punch him in the mouth. Straight That's right it. Just Punch him right in the mouth. Break that arm. Break arm that arm. You like that, ball. Lou? You like that, Lou? You see it? This is what you call for. You call down the thunder. This is what happens. 
in Sunset Flip. My hawk. Whoa, no, no, oh, no. Got him over. Yep. Come on, Brody. Uh, two count by referee Allen Lentz. Very close on the count. Come on, Brody. Brody. Oh, back over the oh. top. Got him up. Oh, right up under him. Come on. Tag on Serpent. Serpent's in. Hawk with the right hand misses. Serpent right hands on Brody Hawk. Hawk misses. Serpent's hat finally comes flying off. Got him in. He calls for 187 to come over and help. Hawk's in. Big splash again. Oh, wait. Held on. Put all through him over the top rope again. Mike Reels comes out. Watch out. Hey, Lou. Behind you, Lou. Look out. Oh, big right hand. Oh. What are you doing? He's over here. What? Oh, come on. Real. Oh, come on. Big Daddy Storm came in. Now look, kicking him. Supposed to be hurt. Kicking him. Come on. Brody Hawk came over. Mike Reels came out. Look, now Reels is going to come out. Working him on. Oh, come on, guys. Come on. Match is over. Oh, here, okay, here comes him some help. JPJ, ah, oh, takes out Devil's Rejects, coming out, taking on Reels. Yeah, they all going, ah, oh, they got Storm covered. Storm, ah, oh, big day Storm gets out. Mike Reels goes to help him. Devil Rejects come out to help. JPJ coming out with, with him, got him. Looking around, I don't know what they're doing. Brody Hawk, we told y'all. We told y'all. I don't know. Them out. What are they doing? Over eating donuts. No, I'm good. I'm good. I don't need that. Mike Reels came out, distracted Big Lou. Big Daddy Storm, I don't even know where he got the chain. Been sitting over here with him the whole time. Don't have a clue where he got the chain from. Hits 187 with a chain. Hawk rolls him up. He got him with a chain. Come on. Big Daddy Storm been talking about the whole time about wrestling. That's not wrestling. Hawk talking about his victory donut. Said, no, I'm you good. I'm good. No, where they came out with donuts. It, this is ridiculous. Like, I don't even know where they got the donuts. I don't even know where Big Daddy Storm got the chain from. That's, I've been sitting with him this whole time. Ridiculous. Ridiculous. Yeah. Ridiculous. Wow. By the end of the day, royalty gets all their gold back today. I don't know what happened with that. Rose up. I, I mean, I, I don't know. Serpent, I saw it. Serpent coming around telling him, I, I, I want some more. Yeah, now they're going to the back. Now it's the numbers are the right. Get them out. Well, ladies and gentlemen, that's a show for today. Here, Savage Brotherhood somehow gets their, all their gold back. Join us next week. Join us next week right here at the Oyo Hotel, 601 Shady Oaks Drive. Maybe next week I'll get my good friend Tiger Williams back. But for Bluff Wrestling Live, I'm Barry Perkins. So long, everybody.